Hey guys, all things Apple here, and this is my Apple collection of late 2018 to late 2019. So, let's get straight into it with the iPads here. I only got one iPad at the moment, but it is an iPad 2 running iOS 6.1.3. I'll just show you here if it doesn't die. And this is actually the first iPad to run iOS 6. And yeah, we've got iOS 6.1.3 there. I'm going to put this iPhone, this iPhone SE over the, the, over the details of it. You can see the iOS 6.1.3. So yeah. I'll put the iPhone SE back. So yeah, and it's actually got 2% charge right now. So yeah, let's put it back. Goes onto the boxes. We've got this iPod Touch 4th generation box. It's for a 16 gigabyte white iPod Touch. You can see it right there. iPod Touch 16 gigabyte white. We've got a black 16 gigabyte iPhone 4S box. And yeah. It is 16 gigabyte and also obviously it is black and it's an iPhone 4S box obviously. Rose gold iPhone SE box for a 64 gigabyte iPhone SE. And yeah, that is for what I just said. And the box is actually broken because it's got t because it's, this tape is actually holding it together. You can see why it's broken right there. And it's actually prob looks like it's broken there as well. Yeah, it's broken there as well. So it's actually to fix that tab back on. You can see it's disgusting and broken. And that bit is not as disgusting, but it's broken. So, yeah. Let's put the boxes back. Move on to the Macs. We've got this MacBook Pro here. 2014, this 13 inch MacBook Pro with Retina display from mid from the middle of 2014 and yeah it's missing one of its rubber stud things on the bottom so yeah I'll just put it back down here and open it up I was binge watching everything Apple Pro on here earlier so yeah and it is running macOS Sierra it is running macOS Sierra at 10.12.6 you can see it right there macOS Sierra 10.12.6 and now let's get rid of that and we'll put it to sleep by closing the lid and now onto the iPods we've got this iPod touch fourth generation here and the reason the screen is in such bad shape is I actually tried to fix it but the screen is not but the screen not the screen if I can actually say it properly the battery is done for because the battery connector that connects to the logic board is actually fried and the digitizer is decaying so it would need a new battery and a board level repair to work again and it's probably not even going to be worth it because it doesn't connect to the internet and it is stuck on iOS 6.1.6 onto the iPhones last but last but not least onto the iPhones and we're going to start with this iPhone here which is an iPhone 4S on iOS 5.1.1 and yes and it's and this is an I and you can actually tell this is well that was close there that was close then I nearly dropped this I, in fact I nearly threw it across the room but yeah you can but yeah it's got a warranty void of remove sticker on it but I'm not going to remove that just for the fun just for, just for fun but I don't actually know where it came from but still, I can't remember. Actually, I can't remember where, where it came from. But yeah, I can't remember where it came from. But still, you can see this is in fact an iPhone 4S because it has got a SIM tray on it. And. And of course. Oh of course, all of the, and the antenna band is there instead of there. And there is another one. There is two antenna bands at the top. 
and two at the bottom and a sim tray on it and it's got the SFC and it's got the FCC labels on it it's got the FCC labels on it so it is indeed an iPhone 4S and this is a 16 gigabyte black iPhone 4S but that box I meant I showed to you before we did the iPod before we did the iPods and the Macs that is not this phone's original box. It is just a box that coincidentally appears to be the same box that this iPhone would have come in. But it is not the actual box that this phone came in. Next up, second to last device of the video, we have this iPhone 4 here. It, you can tell the difference. It is in fact an iPhone 4 because it's got this antenna band here and this antenna band here. And this antenna band here, and it's actually you can actually tell it's an iPhone 4 because the iPhone 4s under under also under all circumstances did not have did not have a antenna band at the top. But I cannot. Add, but if this was a CDMA iPhone 4, that SIM tray would not be there. And also, if I just peel this back a bit, this yellow thing back a bit. Also, these FCC labels would also not be there. So yeah, that is in fact an iPhone 4 GSM model. This is a GSM iPhone 4. So yeah, last but not least, in the whole video, the iPhone SE. The rose gold 64GB iPhone SE running iOS 11.1.1. And by the way, I forgot to say... Well, I didn't forget to say. I actually just didn't say this iPhone 4 is running iOS 7.1.2. Yeah. But this is running iOS 11.1.1. I can't actually show it to you because the screen's totaled. And the LCD screen is damaged and the digitizer does not work. And it is also out of battery power. It is also out of charge. So... That is my Apple Cl So yeah, and by the way, this box is this device's original box. So that box actually had that device in it, so yeah. Actually had that phone in it, so yeah. That is my Apple collection of, two, late, of late 2019, late 2018 to 2019. Well, late 2018 to early 2019, I should say. And yeah, be be sure to follow me on be sure to follow me on all things Apple to iPhone, and you have been watching all things Apple, and this is all things Apple signing off. My uncle's headphones there. Peace, guys.